So that's good. Good questions. Thank you. Any questions? Next agenda is the word of the day. Let's welcome Rajini to provide the word of the day, and we will try our best to reuse the word of the day in our speeches or in our talk. Let's welcome Rajini. the day is vacillate, V-A-C-I-L-L-A-T-E, I don't think anything I can write, V-A-C-I-L-L-A-T-E, vacillate, yeah. it's a verb, the definition is to swing indecisively from one course of action or opinion to another. To swing indecisively from one course of action or option to another. It um, it's a synonymous word, it's a hover, H-O-V-E-R, oscillate, O-S-C-I-L-L-A-T-E, or vibrate. Mm. The usage can be I vacillated about what to say for so long that the man on the phone asked if I was still there. But I was still like holding myself. I don't know what to say, so I was like vacillated. Jason, for our gesture of today, let's give him a big hand. Mr. Toastmaster, fellow members, uh, I vacillated about what jokes I should tell today until this morning that. I uh, decided to tell you what is the following joke. The reason was that I saw a news report That's about a trial in China. Actually, you know G uh, GSK, big pharma, uh, pharmaceutical company. They, some years ago, they hired a British company to investigate a person one employee of JSK in China because that lady was doubted by the company that whether she initiated some action against the company or did some illegal things. So this British company investigated that lady. Later, the company investigators were arrested in China. Recently, they were sent, uh, they, they are couples. Their husband was sentenced to two and a half year uh, imprisonment. And the wife was sentenced to two years for an authorized collection of private information. Because of this, I decided to Talk about, uh, to tell us a joke about the Chinese legal system. Some years ago, a law professor put something on the internet in China. Li Peng is a fool. Li Peng was the chairman of the National People's Congress in China. So then, this law professor was arrested and then later sentenced to seven years uh, in jail. So he said to the judge, no, no, you could not sentence such a heavy uh, sentence because under the Chinese law, uh, you can only sentence me maximum three years because uh, information, uh, defamation in China, the maximum punishment is only three years. The judge said to him, 
Sir, you were charged with an authorized disclosure of a state secret, sir. <laughs> <laughs> Very good, thank you. What am I doing the water? Oh. That's why I have my new one, vessel on seven.